like any other NBA superstar, George Gervin also declined as he got older. The mark began in 1985 when the Spurs shipped him to the Bulls to become a backup shooting guard for then NBA rising star Michael Jordan, who was injured at the time. Iceman still wanted to reach the top, so he kept looking for a way back to it. Unfortunately, he made a wrong turn and found drugs and alcohol. I was real, real depressed. After I left San Antonio, I pretty much quit basketball. Gervin told Tampa Bay Times in 91. I was on the road and another player said, try this. I smoked it and it was like, wow, that's how it made you feel. It was an unnatural high and it went into a natural body. It ain't nothing to fool with. In 1989, a cocaine overdose saw the master of the finger roll hospitalized. Fortunately, Ice recovered and changed his ways. The key to dealing with drugs is making the conclusion that you're sick. If you don't make that conclusion, then you're in trouble, he reflected.